If this was easier to predict or to capture, somebody would have done it already. That's what got me hooked more than anything else, was this potential for telling the ocean story in a unique, powerful way that nobody has seen before. My name is Jeff Orlowski, and I directed the film called Chasing Coral. A couple years ago, I got a, an email out of the blue from a man named Richard Vivers. He attached two photographs, one of a healthy coral reef and one of a dead coral reef. And when I saw those photos, the light bulb immediately went on. It's like, if you can document that change, you can reveal this to the public in a powerful way. So we knew from the start that there was something that we wanted to get involved with. We put together an amazing team of filmmakers, scientists, and engineers. As a filmmaking team, we've been able to build some unprecedented technology. Zach on the team is phenomenal. He built the camera systems. He knows Coral like the back of his hand. Richard's background is in communications and in advertising. He's been trying to rebrand this whole issue. We've been working on this film now for over three years. We went to Bermuda, to Australia, to Hawaii, to American Samoa, to all these different regions, chasing this phenomenon of bleaching that has been rather elusive and has been incredibly difficult to capture in a powerful way. It's really hard to wrap your head around charts and numbers, but when people see visuals that tells that story, they get it in a completely different way. I feel like as filmmakers, we are translators for the scientific community. We know that the oceans are changing. And more than anything, I feel a responsibility to capture it because we know it's happening.